Well, now it's time to start doing some real lessons on loading sounds and setting up uh, maybe your own drum kit and maneuvering with your computer. So, of course, it's the MPC Touch, but it's got to be connected to your computer. So you need to know where all your samples are and where your sound libraries are and how to access them. So it's pretty simple. We can press Shift and then we're going to press this menu button, which means we're going to access the browser. And let's go back again to main. And you want to do it even easier. You can just press this one here, go to main, and select browser. So it's a couple ways to get there. And that's how to get the browser. So as you can see here in browser, what's currently selected here is the song. See that right there? It's currently selected, a little red line right there. And here it has projects, right? This is a project selected right here. And it gives us a list of everything that's there. You'll notice here also, there's a little triangle right there, and it says here, MPC drum content, forward slash drum kits. And this is that folder that's for the MPC, it's on my computer. See that's a folder right there, right? Now of course, if I go to here and double tap, it'll show me more than just that. It shows me that folder and other folders the MPC loop library, essential elements, the vault, MPC documents. You can see that? And I have other items that are on my computer. I can go to my desktop. So I can browse anywhere on my computer. In this case, I just want to use the MPC drum content. Now also, let's say, for example, um, I want to see samples. Now here, I'll see samples that are already on my MPC. And they're right there. So I can see the samples that we already have, right? I have no sample, I can audition. Hmm. This little triangle here, it's my audition. I can go to here, and this is the audition volume. I can increase it or decrease it. See that? And I can go right back here to projects where I left off at. I can select projects right here and I'll get a current list. You sort of see this most of the time on the software on your MPC, on your computer, and you'll see this list where you have the project, the program, the sequence, and right here you'll see the samples. They're all right there. So now I'm going to go back here, close it out again, and I want to, I'm here, I'm in song, right? And I want to select something here. So I'm going to select this thing here, Avenue, right? Nope, right here. It says Avenue right there. And once I select it, I want to load it in. So right here is the load. And it says here, something currently. And do I want to like go to the next sequence and load it? Sure, I'll do that. Let's load it. And it loads it in. Now, that was the song. I want to load the program now. So I press that program button there. And now I'm, I'm going to select this. And I want to load the program in. So I've loaded in the song, which has the sequences. And I've loaded in the program. 